Today we are going to create a 3D CAD model of a wine bottle. Open up the project brief, which is in Moodle. Familiarize yourself with what's required. Uh, please print this off and refer to throughout the exercise. Let's begin by launching Google SketchUp 8. Choose template. Select product design, millimeters. Start using SketchUp. Begin by drawing a line from the origin up along the blue axis of length 40 millimeters. Zoom in using the scroll wheel. Draw another line across parallel to the red axis of length 15 mil and straight down of length 40. For clarity, let's go to camera, standard views, front, and camera, parallel projection. Draw a line across along the red axis of length 20, up 20, across 5, and connect, creating the triangle as shown on screen. Draw a line from the end point, up a length of 20 millimeters, parallel to the blue axis. Now erase the construction lines as shown. Go to line, create a line from the origin up along the blue axis of length 120 millimeters across by 40 millimeters and connect as shown. Next, we are going to create another line again from the origin up along the blue axis this time of length 240 across of length 15 and connect as shown erase the construction line again line from end point up a distance of 50 millimeters and across by 15 Next go to View, turn off the axes and delete the construction line which was hidden by the axes. Again, turn on the axes. Now we are going to create an arc from the end point to the midpoint. Move the cursor towards the inside of the bottle and assign a bulge value of 3. Another arc. Midpoint to end point. Away from the bottle this time. Bulge value of 3. And next we erase the construction lines as shown. Let's zoom towards the base of the bottle. Arc, end point to end point, bulge value of one millimeter. Erase the construction line. Now we're going to draw a line from the end point to the midpoint. And erase. Draw an arc from the end point to end point, bulge value of 1. And we're going to erase the construction line as before. Now we are going to assign a thickness to the bottle. We do this by choosing offset. Move the cursor in, add a value of 3 millimeters. Next, we are going to erase some of the extraneous lines. And now we have to extend some of those offset lines as shown. Draw a line from here to the blue axis. Zoom to the top. Draw a line. End point to the perpendicular. Erase the line to the left. 
Now we want to assign a radius to the rim of the bottle draw line from the midpoint by 0.5. Draw a circle from the endpoint. There's the radius. And erase the construction lines. And there we have a profile for the bottle. Let's go into our ISO view. Draw a line from the origin up along the blue axis of length 350 millimeters across parallel to the red axis this time of length 25 millimeters. Draw a circle, center, radius end point. Now we need to delete some construction lines. So we go to view, turn the axes off, and erase construction lines as shown. Now to convert the profile into a 3D model, we have to go to tools and select follow me. Move the cursor to the inside of the profile, select, press down the alt key and choose the disk and select. Now we need to erase the disk and let's orbit our model to make sure there are no flaws. Perfect. Next we'll go to view, turn on the shadows, back in to view, and we're going to turn the edges off. Now we are going to assign a material to the object, so select the entire object, go to paint bucket, choose translucent, we're going to choose dark green glass, and drop it to the object. Close the paint bucket tool. Go file, save as, um, save this to your H drive and to your pen drive. And we're going to title this as wine bottle. And save. Exit and hit maybe later. And that concludes that tutorial.